Hello everybody and welcome back to Just Pick One with Curly and Young. Quack. Yay, we're playing Rockwin. Mm-hmm. Back yeah, again. Okay. Um, what were we doing? I don't really know. Oh, we're gonna say. Okay. Oh, oh no. Is that sad girl? Sue. Shit, why am I eating pretzels when I know I have to voice act characters? Because... Was just casually playing a video game. I am in such an ultimate snack mood. Snacks are good. Well, no, I'm excited because I just signed the lease papers. <laughs> yeah, you guys officially. I actually live somewhere now. <laughs> yeah, he's not just living with his sister. I'm not a drifter anymore. Oh, drift I right, actually... drift right into my heart. Oh, I will. You already did drift into my heart. Mhm. Mm it was good. I like it there. I'm gonna stay. But now we're gonna play games. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Where is my friend gone? I can't sleep until I find her. Does she know she's like incorporeal? I don't know. Ghost. There's a cave over there. We should go over to it. Can we jump across? Over there? Yeah. Um, I, no, like where she I, I went. Don't I don't know how so she I... got how she got there. I can see the like ladder. Oh yeah, she jumped behind the waterfall. But like, are Free. we allowed that way? You can go down into the water, but you can't do anything. You can't swim. You have to drain everything. Is Sue. It? Oh, hi. What are you doing? Trying to remember where I was supposed to meet my friend. I have to find her. She needs me. I love this idea that she just forgets. Oh, <laughs> Every... Hi! <sighs> Tell me about your friend. Oh, she's the best. She was the only one who would listen to me. She was such a good listener. I could tell her all my secrets because I knew she'd never tell anyone else. Is she alive? It sounds like a stuffed dog. And she loved me no matter what. Even though I was poor and didn't have cool toys or games. Even though I didn't have any other friends. She still loved me. Oh, hi! <laughs> what kind of stuff did you do? I know what I used to do when I was, when I was a poor child. Did you know? I didn't tell you about this, did I? Probably. When I would have friends over for sleepovers. Yeah. Which I, I didn't get to do often, but whatever. Um, I'd bring I'd bring my friends over, and we'd watch movies. Mm -hmm. Uh, namely movies with like car chase scenes. Um, and I would have I'd I'd bring out a bunch of pillows and like paper plates, and we could all like build our own cars and sit in the cars while they were doing the car chase scene and then so I did that. Aww. Cause no like I have That's the, cute. the actor quality of like oh we're gonna hang over at Jan's house. There's gonna be some fucking imagination happening. Oh hell yeah. You're gonna imagine that, shit. That and I would take um paper towels. Yeah. The long thin ones and fold them over and fill them with stuffing and then stitch up the sides with, you know, just needle and thread and just do like little stitching courses with my friends and we would like decorate them with buttons and stuff. Aww. Yeah, we'd That's make so little cute. like paper pillows. I was definitely not that gay when I was young. Well, I didn't have a lot of money. I don't know. I, like, I, I don't know, know what I did for... Myself. I don't even know what I did for like... That sounds way more, in more interesting than what I would do for like, whatever sleepovers. Yeah. Mine were just like, oh, my friends came over, we played some video games, and then we went to bed. I wish I'd done that. That's normal. Yeah, but normal's boring. <laughs> yeah, the normal grass is always greener on the other life. side. Huh? The grass is always greener on the other side. Yeah, I just feel like normal prepares you for real life more. I am not prepared for real life. Neither am I. 
Eh, okay, then maybe we're both screwed. Glad we can be screwed together. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, video game. Something that's screwing. Mm-hmm. Anyways, <clears throat> video game. Oh, and we had so many adventures together. And we played a lot of games, too. Ones I didn't get to play before. My dad promised he would play catch with me, but he left, and we never got to do that together. But my friend loved playing catch. So we'd go to the park and play catch until the sun went down. Oh, hi. See ya. It's the best response to oh, hi. Oh, hi. Okay, so we need to figure out... I'm not being stuck. I have to water them in my world. I get that. So we got an axe. Um, do we want to? Maybe we should go back to our world. Chop that... down the trees. No. Yeah, no. Winston needs me. And then chop down like the things. Why are you going that way again? Because I'm just looking at it. Okay. I. Do you have like a fan in your room? Can you hear it? Do you have one? Ceiling fan. Okay, I can hear a little bit of something. It's very light. Okay. Because it's hot as balls today, so I need that on. Oh yeah, go ahead, keep it on. Where are we going? Um, to the inn. That's right, back to the real world. Yeah, it's a little bassy, but that's about it. That's not the inn. That's the wrong one. It's the one that says in on it. That's this one. Mm-hmm. Hi, guys. You have anything new to say? Recently, the river water levels were getting dangerously low. So the great water dragon, Stormy... The Stormy? Is it French? Stormy. The great water dragon, Stormy... Hmm? Okay, Stormy, I guess? No, I'll say Stormy. It's just an extra Y. So the great water dragon Stormy moved here to fix things. Now we have all the water we could possibly need. Oh, like... Except for, like, not enough to with the emerald bean stalks and all. Yeah, come on. Make those grow. Yes, Stormy, what's your fucking explanation for that not working out for you? Chop down the wall. I'm sorry, I'm just having an emotion. Mom, what the fuck just happened? Well, obviously, when it, they went into the weird alternate universe. No one's going to question this? Nope. I still have the axe, and no one's going to question this. Where, where did you get that axe? You found. Amber marble, yay! Oh, 25 gold, shit. A ladder. Okay. I want to return yeah, I some of the marbles to it. Sue. Huh? No. No, that's... The, uh, your fan. But it's not that bad. Keep going. Please don't ignore there's, me. Sorry, there, sorry, there's also, like, traffic sounds and plane sounds and water sounds. It's very active. You live in a city now. I know, right? You're a city, a city boy now. Okay, we're gonna have to go to the second floor storage wing because shit's going down. Wait a tick. Where are you? Okay, yeah. What? Where are you going? Never mind. Down. I know. What did you, like, forget? What? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Keep going. Oh, I was just backtracking into that room to remember where I'd walk from. That's the bathroom. Oh. Oh no. I'm, I'm very sorry. I'm very sorry about this, Winston. I just can't believe someone would do something like this. Stealing a wedding band from a comatose woman. These are indeed desperate times. We will do all we can to try and find out who stole this from her. I 
Thank you for your help, Doctor. I understand how busy everyone must be right now, so this means a lot. Of course. And if you could spare some extra blankets, it would be very appreciated. I know they've boarded up the hole inside the bathroom wall, but there's still a very chilling wind coming through. I'm very sorry about that, Winston. We'll send over some supplies. Thank you. I'll come by later to check on Gemma. Gemma? Gemma. Gemma? Gemma. On Gemma. In the meantime, please take care. It can be pronounced Gemma. There was a book that my sister was reading out loud. Because my that's what my family does. That's what we do. Uh, there was a book that my sister was reading out loud where the main character's name was Gemma. And she called her Gemma. And she thought it was the prettier version of the name. But there was a scene where one of the boys gave her a ring and he said, A gem for my Gemma. And Chelsea was like, oh, so it is pronounced Gemma. Oh. Yeah. Should we go through every single uh, place and just chop down them? Or are we going straight to Winston's wives? Hmm. Well, I kind of wanted to give the marbles back to Sue, but I'm worried if I go in there, we'll immediately talk to Winston. Well, I can't break this one down. This doctor's here. We're trying our best to patch things up after what happened. But we don't have the best materials right now. Can I just be the first to mention this is a shit hospital? Oh, yeah. As you can tell, there's still a cold breeze coming through the boards behind me. If the patient in this room would stop trying to sneak into the area behind here, maybe we could get this wall fixed. He keeps taking construction supplies to go digging in the mud outside. I think he's looking for buried treasure. I don't think he's wrong. I can't get around here to break that. Mm. Of course I want to chat with everyone. We're not at this moment. The door is locked. Great. Um. The door is locked. I know, the story wants me to go... I shouldn't recheck the lockers. They're not gonna, like, refill with stuff. No. Really? So. Like, you have not used money once. Yeah, like, I have. For what? I, I bought the peanut smacky. Oh, yeah. Hey, actually, you should check if the thing's open. The it coffee. Does, uh... I should see if the coffee's up. Oh, this is yeah, the other coffee. room. Yeah, coffee. So this is where the old guy lives. Hey, old guy. What book is this? Airplanes. Cool, yeah, cool. You already know about that book. Yes, I remember. Now. Now that I've burped. Nothing there. I swear there was I more know. bathrooms. I'm wondering what... Or I'll do hole. to adjust the water level if it's like flushing toilets or flooding sinks. What I'll do to adjust the water level in the, in the real world? Lebel world. Probably the same thing we did last time. Try to take over the world. Bam. Mm-hmm. Me and you. Rulers huh. of the world. Okay. I love how I didn't read any of these signs yet. That's good, we already know whose room is whose. Okay, cutscene. Oh, Gemma. I'm sorry about all of this. Poor Winston. Oh! What is it, Mom? While we're here, do you think Sue might like the cat's eye marble we got from Jackie? Good idea, Mom! I was gonna do that anyway. I think she would. That was my plan for coming in this room. I didn't want to deal with Winston. Oh, she's so sad. Oh, hey. You came back. It's good to see you again. What's new? Nothing. I've been... Did you hear? Someone stole Gemma's wedding ring. Yeah, I knew that, actually. Danielle said that on the first day. That. But we didn't realize it was stolen. Yeah. We thought she just didn't have it on. Yeah, we thought there was a problem in the marriage aside from the comatose wife. Gemma? Oh, Gemma is Winston's wife. I share a room with her. 
Isn't that awful, though? I mean, who would steal something like that from a woman in a coma? I'm beginning to think that the thief isn't a very nice person after all. That's my usual assumption with thieves. But then, then you have to remember that, like, sometimes they actually need stuff. Ain't no rest for the wicked. Money don't grow on trees. You brought me something? It isn't much, but I remembered that you collect marbles. Gifts are the cat's eye marble. <laughs> no. And give the cat's eye marble to Sue. Ah, it's Cat Planet! Cat Planet! Is there a show about that? Cat Planet? Cookie Remember Cat. Planet Unicorn. No, I don't think there is a cat planet. There wasn't an episode of Being Puppy Cat. It mm. was a it was a bathhouse reminiscent reminiscent of the bathhouse in Spirited Away, but it was all like cat aliens. Mm, okay. Right. Cat planet. Cat planet. Oh, I really missed this one. It really looks like a cat's eye, doesn't it? That's because this planet has lots of cats. But here's the surprising part. It has a lot of dogs, too. There's dogs living there, too? Oh, yes. People are always saying that cats and dogs can't get along. But that's just not true. People are all- people always think that if you're different, that means you're bad. And then they treat you differently. Like if you don't look the same, or if you don't have money anymore. Even if it's not your fault, they treat you bad because you're different from them. I know what you mean. The cat planet is different. The cats and dogs get along just fine. In fact, there's a bakery here that's run by cats and dogs. The cats and dogs make the food together? Yeah! It's really good, too. They have pink donuts and coconut bread. I love coconut bread! No, you don't. Children do not like coconut. You don't like coconut until you at least hit age 12. I like coconut. Baby, you're over age 12. <laughs> I don't know if I like... I don't know. Coconut's okay. Coconut's good. I like what's wrong with coconut? Like why can't people under age twelve like coconut? It's like people who don't like raisin oatmeal cookies. You yeah, you gain a taste for them as you age, I swear to god. And then people complain they're like people who like raisin oatmeal cookies are terrible. It's like no, you like raisin oatmeal cookies. If someone offered you a raisin oatmeal cookie, you would eat it because you are a human if being. If someone offered me any kind of cookie <laughs> Like, probably including if they were like, hey, this is heavily poisoned, but it's a cookie. I'd be like, fuck yeah, cookies. Yep. And this is how Jan is going to die. Oh, it's real easy. <laughs> I didn't know you could cook. I didn't know you were allergic to rat poison. Hey. Hey, can I ask you something? No. Why do you keep snooping around our bathroom? Is there something cool in there? Can you keep a secret? I won't tell anyone. I think there might be a door down there. A special door. The Twilight Zone. Where does it lead? To a place called Morizora's Forest. I'm trying to wake up the guardian of the forest so he'll grant me a wish. And I already know, I don't know if I said this, I know how this is gonna end. The kid's gonna wish for someone else and not for himself, and he's gonna die of whatever debilitating illness he has. My reaction right now is Sue. That, I can oh, come see, on. yeah, I can no, see that, I can see that happening. The moment anyone, and the moment any sick child is like, I need to oh. make a wish. You know it's gonna be like, they get, they're like on their last leg of life. 
and they're, they're in front of this spirit that's gonna grant them the wish, and they're I like mean... either bleeding out or or they've only got like two days left to live, and they're like, I just wish that my family will be happy. And you're like, fuck you, child! Fuck you! Oh, uh, yeah. yeah no, I they always wish for, like, world peace or someone else to have a meal or something. It's yeah, like, no. They're like, oh, fucking no. be selfish. It's... Or it, they're gonna make you choose. Hmm? They're gonna make you choose. Oh, fuck. Alright. Keep reading. They're gonna do that ending. Sorry. No, the last game that did that ending was this kind of style, too. That was, um... Oh god, what was it called? One shot. It had one of those super hard choice endings. And it left it to you. Oh, there was so much more to that game that needed to be explored. Ah. So you have Secret Worlds too? I do. Hmm. Well, the shift leader's in the bathroom now. So you might not be able to look around for your door. Unless... Here, give her one of these. Peanut Choo Choo! Do I have a name yet? Oh, you're a boy. I'm still just boy. Shut I up. think you can be whatever bo name you want to be. Reginald. Thanks, Sue. She loves these. Good luck. Okay, let's go bribe someone. Pardon me, shift leader. Alright, but, um, actually we're gonna end the episode. Oh, okay. Sorry. We'll bug the shift leader next episode, then. Yep. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.